we're short staffed all the time and there's there's little to no end to this. A better nurse to patient ratio. That's just one of the things healthcare workers at a local hospital want to ensure in contract negotiations. McLaren Bay region workers held a rally this afternoon to help the community understand what they're fighting for. Lenita Brooks shares why workers believe a victory for them is a victory for the community. Any employer that pays workers less than $15 an hour in 2023, we got a problem with them. Absolutely. We're here to be patient advocates for our patients, people that we're looking out for our people here. McLaren healthcare workers of various backgrounds gathered today in Bay City to demand change. We're out here today because we're not getting anywhere with McLaren. Higher pay and better working conditions are some of the things they're asking for safe patient ratios, um, competitive and fair staffing or um, wages. Um, we're short staffed all the time and there's there's little to no end to this. I mean every single day we come in and we have floors that are short every single day. Unite here local 24 union members have been negotiating new contracts with McLaren since February but they say the hospital won't budge. And it's slow like we have no articles but two that are completed, um, everything else has been denied by us, by them. McLaren said in a statement to TV5, quote, we are hopeful that we will reach a mutually agreeable contract in the very near future. Until that time, our focus will continue to be serving the patients who come to our hospital and entrust us with their care. Union members say they are doing this for the patients. My biggest concern is just patient safety. Um, this is our community hospital. Uh, we all work here, we all live here, and we care so much about this community. We just want the right thing to be done for the community and for us. They say the last three years have been emotionally, physically, and mentally draining, and they won't rest until a resolution is reached. For WNEM TV5, I'm Lenita Brooks. And back in March, the Michigan Nurses Association said when nurses have too many patients, it puts patients in danger. The number of nurses who say they know of a patient death due to nurses having too many patients nearly doubled from 22% in 2016 to 42% this year.